Hey guys, just want to apologize. I'm guilty of the crime of vertical filming. Um, I was using a new GoPro, and the logo, the GoPro logo on the back, I thought that needed to be right side up, but apparently not. Apparently the logo goes sideways, so the button on the top, the record button, goes on the top, not on the side. So, that's my excuse, and... I will avoid vertical filming in the future. So yeah, sorry. Hello everybody, I'm here outside St. Macar's Cathedral in Aberdeen, Scotland. This place was built around the year 580 AD by St. Macar. He came to Scotland from Ireland because he wanted to spread the faith. So as you can imagine, this place is almost 1500 years old. There's a lot of history here. A lot of these graves are pretty old too, they're pretty cool to look at. This place is one of the oldest churches in Scotland. It was demolished and rebuilt a few times. And also, fun fact, when William Wallace died, they tore him limb from limb and they sent parts of his body all over Scotland as a reminder not to rebel. And part of him, I believe his left leg, is buried inside the walls of that building. It's a cool place, they have church every Sunday, and also during the weekdays, it's open to the public. They have a lot of historical stuff inside they like to show off. So let's take a look around. The church was built in this spot in particular because the River Don is just down there, past the tree line. Um, it was built here because when St. Macar came, he said that God told him to build it in a place where the river curves around and looks like a bishop's staff. So I'll show you what I mean when I get to a better spot above this valley. That's the cathedral up there. Looks pretty awesome. So here we can see part of the river. The other part is on the other side of that island there. Kind of splits in half here. So here's a better place to see it. The river kind of curves around, snakes in on itself like the head of one of those, one of the bishop staffs with like the curvy, yeah. And there's the valley, and if you can see through the trees, at the very top of the cathedral is over on the other side, on the other hill. So, here we are.
And I'm just walking around right now because it's a beautiful spring day in Scotland. I saw like two dogs already. It's a great day. Found a cool bridge. Brigo Balgoni. Built about thirteen twenty. This is cool. Awesome view from right here. One mile to the mouth of the river, or maybe one kilometer. Piece of litter I found. Reminder that Europe does not joke around with their anti-smoking ads. They are not subtle. I seen one with like a naked guy lying in bed like curled up in fetal position that says smoking may increase risk of impotence. They are not subtle. Don't smoke kids. Crikey, it's a mallard duck. And look at the two females next to it. They got the brown feathers, the camouflage. So I found the other bridge. I was walking along that path to the right there. You can probably hear there's a ton of traffic behind me. You can see there's the beach on the other side there. It's a bit cold for swimsuit weather, but for Scotland, it's a warm day. I like this weather. For the magic that is accidentally making a big circle, I find myself back on the other side of Seaton Park. So I'm looking across the valley, and there's the hill I was climbing, and over there's the cathedral, you can see it. Nice little duck pond there. I love crows. Scots 
way will wars blood Scots one bruise has often led Welcome to your gory bed Or to victory Nazi and Nazi See the front Let him turn and flee. Oh, for Scotland's king and lord, freedom's sword will strongly draw. Freeman stand or freeman fall. Let him follow me. By your sons in several chains We will drain our dearest veins But they shall be free history here filming along the River Don in Aberdeen, Scotland. I want to let everyone know that I love learning about history, not just in books, but by seeing cool places too. So if you know of any place within about 300 miles of Philadelphia that has a neat bit of history, neat bit of culture, my email is in the description below. Write me about it and I might just come visit.